Yo, what's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Kai X Limitless. We back with another one. And DJ Academics is spinning the block on Meek Mill. There should be classes and studies on how Meek Mill was able to fumble his career by making one misstep after another misstep after another misstep. You know, before Meek Mill started his music career, he should have read the book, The Art of War. And one key rule is to always know your enemy before you get into war with them. Meek Mill is very quick at the mouth and very quick at the fingers to start posting stuff on Twitter, say all kind of things about other people. And then you create enemies that are much better than you in certain areas, right? And one thing Meek Mill has no understanding of the internet. And yet he keeps running to the internet and keep making these weird moves and always looking crazy and end up being the butt of the joke. And every time Meek Mill goes up against somebody, they understand the internet to a high level and they understand the optics, right? How things will be perceived on social media. And being a rapper, a lot of that is perception, right? And reputation. You know, Meek Mill even got humiliated by six, nine of all people. Meek Mill online said, you know, I'm going to smoke you. And when I run into you, I'm going to do this and that. And he runs into 6 9 and Meek Mill hides behind his security. And, you know, all these L's start to stack up quickly. And, of course, the Drake B pretty much X's Meek Mill all the way out of the rap game, right? He's been, you know, pretty much demoted since then. You know, I haven't heard a single Meek Mill song since Drake dropped back to back. And now, of course, there's the Twitter war that Meek Mill is at war with DJ Academics on Twitter which is another major misstep, right? Meek is very stupid for throwing shots at people that he's not ready to go to war with. And that was his key mistake with Drake, right? So check out DJ Academics speak about how he pretty much put the nail in the coffin to Meek Mill's career and how DJ Academics is going to continue to humiliate Meek and that Meek made a lifetime enemy out of DJ Academics by threatening his life. Telling why he was reporting bad about people, Meek. I will say this to you, your face, in your, on your deathbed. I killed your career, what was left of it. Me. You disrespected me nine years ago, and I kept it, and I'm like an elephant. I will never forget. Please don't try to bring up anything else. I laugh, and I, 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 I Meek, I will never in my life make sure you're, if I see you at the top of the charts, trust me, I'm having a bad day. I, 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 I laugh. I, I have a good time. I have my feet kicked up. I jack off to the fact that your career is six feet under because you disrespected a nigga who was born in Spanish Town, Jamaica, nigga, who happened to now have hip hop in the palm of his hands. Back, I killed it. Drake killed it. The game killed it. Rick Ross killed it. Even though you cool with him now, they all killed it. But I issued the last and final blow. You could tweet about me all you want to tweet, my nigga. But trust me, your counterparts called me every day and said, Act, you a bad motherfucker. You killed that nigga's career. So let me know what y'all think in the comment box. And I think people underestimate DJ Academics. He can use the social media to make narratives on you. And DJ Academics has the power to very negatively, you know, impact your career. He almost got Nav's career out of here when he beefed with Nav. And we saw how Lil Baby wasn't the same after beefing with DJ Academics. So, you know, Act is very influential when it comes to swaying the public on people's opinion on certain rappers so let me know what y'all think in the comment box you know do y'all think it was smart for meek mill to block dj academics and to continue dissing him on twitter and you know my whole thing is i don't understand what is meek mill's objective right is he a rapper or is he a blogger podcaster at this point you know he posts so much he might as well start podcasting and get paid for that because you know what I mean? A lot of these things that Meek Mill feels and is upset about, you know, that should be in a rap song. You should be making bars about DJ Academics. You should have been making bars about Drake and how he is a ghostwriter. And that should have been where we heard that Drake has ghostwriters, not on your Twitter page, right? So let me know what y'all think in the comment box. Appreciate y'all for rocking with me. Like the video, subscribe, and we gone.